Alrighty guys, so now that we've created our service, the next step is to generate some API credentials. These API credentials are critical because they're what allow us to connect to the service from our local machine. So without these credentials, we wouldn't actually be able to use the classifier. So what we're gonna do now is create these credentials and then we'll take a look at the next steps eventually in the next video. So what we're gonna do is we're going to go over to here and hit service credentials. And we're gonna create a new credential. So we'll hit new credential. And this is sort of like a new user basically to our, our API. So we're gonna say first user to use, uh, we'll just call it first user. Right, we'll leave the role as manager, um, service ID, that's fine, we can leave that blank, or you can hit auto generate, not really all that important for now, and hit add. So this is actually creating a new credential, and once that new credential has been created, or that new user, you can see here that we'll have a new user or credential generated under here. Now what you wanna pay particular attention to is this. So once you open up view credentials, this is what we're going to need to actually start using our service. So copy that down the API key because we'll use it in the next step once we start interacting with the API using Python. 